what's up y'all welcome to my channel yes yes okay so today i am going to be doing my first get ready with me video and no before we start i'm not a makeup expert i'm not a hair expert none of that this is just going to be a simple get ready with me video these are the things that i actually do as far as and i don't even know if i really set the camera up right because again this is my first time ever doing a get ready with me and i'm gonna do a little story time as well and my story time will actually include me telling you guys about my experience with my breast reduction um i've been meaning to make a video on this for a while and i just haven't had time so now that i actually have some time to do that i am going to share with you guys my experience i don't even know if i am actually too close into the camera right now i really don't know i probably should have laid all my stuff out see that's how you know i'm just not you know you know y'all forgive me but anyways we're going to go ahead and get into the story as of why I got my breast reduction and how my experience was. So, I used to have big breasts. I was probably like an E. Um, I've had big breasts all my life. It's just something that I have always dealt with. And I was always scared. I'm like, it's no way I am going to get surgery because, like, I'm scared. Like, I hate pain. I hate all of this stuff. Sorry, y'all. I'm going to grab my mirror a little bit. But I hate pain. I hate all of that stuff. So I'm like, it's no way that I... This is my mirror I'm using. I got stuff on the sofa. But I always said that it's no way that I would ever get a surgery because I'm like... I'm scared. Like, I'm a scaredy cat. So, one day, my best friend was always telling me like, hey... You know, you seem like you really want to get that because you always talk about it. So, she's like, I think that you should just go for it. Like, do it. If that's what you really want to do, then you should do it. Like, don't be scared. Go for it, you know. Take a leap on faith. And I wanted it because I couldn't really wear cute things. Like, who wants to not be able to wear a cute button-down shirt in the fall? Right. Nobody. So that was my struggle. I couldn't wear any button down shirts that I wanted to wear. I really couldn't wear anything. And it was just becoming, you know, a little depressing because I really wanted to, um, and I'm just slightly filling in my brows and I'm going to conceal them as well. But it was just becoming a, and this is a quick face y'all. Like this is a natural look, simple face. Like you can do this in literally 15 minutes. But anyways, so, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, basically, long story short, I really wanted the um, breast reduction. It was just something that had been on my mind forever. Yes, I was scared. But at the same time, I was like, hey, Brianna, this is what you really want. You've been talking about this forever. So, you might as well just do it. Like, it's no need in putting it off. It's no need in saying you know, you're going to wait till later. Like, it's best to do it while you're young. So, finally, y'all, I just, you know, I stopped being scared. And I was just like, hey, I am, I'm going to go ahead and do it. Like, I'm not going to be scared anymore. I am just going to, I'm going to go with it. I know I'm probably fumbling around, y'all. I should have had all this together. But, um, this is my brow pencil I use, which is by Brandy V the girl from making where i used to live she sent me some of those and i'm going to conceal my brows with this toffee color but back to the story so um you know i i was like okay i'm done being scared like if this is what i want hold on y'all Okay, so I was like, I'm done being scared. If this is what I want, then this is what I'm going to have to go with. Like, I'm going to have to stop being scared. I'm going to go ahead and set up all my appointments, and I am going to roll with it. And I'm going to blend that also. So, I ended up setting up my appointment or whatever, and 
I was like, I'm going. Like, you know, I'm going. Like, that's it. So, um, I set up my consultation first. So, once I set up my consultation, we talked everything out. And he was just like, you know, you seem like you really want to get this done. So, you should go ahead and, you know, just pay what you need to pay. And go ahead and schedule your appointment. And after I had spoke with him, like, he had me just super, super, super excited. I was extremely ready. So, I was like, you know what? He's right. I am ready to get this done. Like, this is something that I've been talking about forever. So, let me just go ahead and pay my money and get with it. So, pretty much, that's what happened. I paid my money. We got to it. Sorry, y'all. But I paid my money. We got to it, and that was just what that was. So, um, and I'm gonna go in with my foundation. This is the SPF 15 Foundation Match Master. I'm just gonna put a few squirts. This is kind of how I do mine. But anyways. I look like, um, what's that lady name off Wizard of Oz? <laughs> but anyways, let me find my brush. This is a BS small brush. I'm just going to go in and blend it. But anyways, y'all. So, he could tell that it was something that I had been wanting for a while. And he really, like, kind of pushed me. My best friend pushed me and my family pushed me. Like, go ahead and get it if that's what you really want to do. And it was what I really wanted. So, set up my appointment with my doctor. And I actually had it done in December of 2015, actually. So, got it done. And I got home, like, maybe a day before Christmas. I think it was the day before Christmas when I got it. Sorry, y'all. I think it was the day before Christmas when I got it. And I was really sore the first day I was. I was really, really sore. However, I stayed taking my pain pills. My pain pills was, like, extremely helpful, y'all, because they were, I mean, they kept me out of pain. And I didn't think I really would need them, but I actually took a few for the first maybe two or three days. After the first or two, after the first, let's see, the first three days, I really didn't need them as much. And I'm not going to put no lashes on in this video. I'm going to do my lashes later because, y'all, it'll take me forever. Once I learn it, then I'll do, like, everything. But, um, anywho, so, I took my pain pills probably, like, the first three days. Everybody's pain level is different. I'm really sensitive when it comes to pain, so I can't really take pain well that most people may be able to take pain. So, some people may say they don't actually need to take theirs at all, but I need, I need it to. So, um... And I'm highlighting now. But anyways, so took my pain medicine. I'm everywhere in this video. <laughs> I'm just rambling. But uh, I took my pain medicine or whatever, which was good. And I was straight. I was sore. Um, I have a desk job. So I was able to go back to work after like a week. And I was fine. Like I was actually bored um, that week that I was at home. Like doing nothing. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, that week that I was actually at home doing nothing, like, I was so freaking bored, and I was just ready to go back, because I'm like, you know, I'm feeling good, like, I was ready to go out, have me a drink, I was ready to do all of that good stuff, because I had gotten bored, but I said all that, really, to just say that, if it's something that you want, you should definitely do it, like, do it, because... It's going to boost your confidence. It's just going to make you feel better overall. It's going to stop your back problems. You'll be able to wear what you want to wear. So I definitely say do it. Like go for what you feel is going to be good for you. And just do it. If it's something that you feel like, hey, you know, I feel like if I do this, it'll make me happy. Then do what makes you happy. Like I would tell anybody it was worth it. Yeah, the pain was a little steep in the beginning. It was a little hard to deal with. But it was good and it was worth it and it's something that i can say there's something that i don't regret getting i'm very glad that i got it 
I love being able to wear the crop tops I can wear now. I love being able to wear the plaited shirts that I can wear now. Like, I just love being able to wear a lot of things that I couldn't wear then, having big breasts that I can actually wear now. So, do it. Take the leap. Do it. Do what you got to do. <laughs> Period. <laughs> but, um... Also, make sure you have some comfortable sports bras and stuff like that. Some doctors do drains. Some doctors don't. My doctor didn't do drains, which I was actually happy about because people said, you know, it's less pain when you don't have drains because I didn't have to worry about um, going back to get, like, drains or anything removed. So, I mean, I guess that was kind of good because I didn't have to deal with that. I had dissolvable stitches, so I didn't have to worry about letting them snatch some things out because i i know friends who have actually had those and they said that it was super painful um having to go and get the stitches taken out and they wish they would have been able to get dissolvable stitches but overall y'all it was a great experience you will definitely love it i'm pretty sure i'm not covering everything in the video because i just kind of came up with this at the last minute just to kind of share a little bit about my story just to let y'all know that it's worth it and if it's something that you want to do, do it. So, with all that being said, and I'm baking now. I'm actually using, um, oops, I'm actually using Laura Mercier. I finally find a color that actually looks good on me. Well, that I can actually bake with because I ain't trying to be looking ashy out here. You feel me? But, um... And I'm going to dust this off in a second. But, anywho. So, yeah. This video is already kind of long. This is my contour palette. However, I'm not going to contour on camera. I'm not going to put my lashes on on camera. I'm just going to put on some mascara. And keep it moving. But, anywho. So, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to answer all of my questions in this video. But, if there is anything that... I didn't answer because I just kind of went through the basics. Feel free, if you are interested in getting a breast reduction, feel free to drop a comment below. Feel free to ask me who my doctor was. Feel free to ask me any type of questions, and I will definitely answer them. Again, this was just a quick video, quick get ready with me. First get ready with me ever. I'm still learning how to edit. I'm still learning how to place the cameras. I'm still learning how to do a lot of different stuff. So, no, this is not going to be a video that is going to be perfect. No, my editing is not going to be just awesome. And I'm actually dusting this stuff off. But I just wanted to come drop by and share that story with you guys. So I'm going to dust all of this off. But again, if y'all have any questions, um, you probably won't even get to see the finished look because, again, this video is already about to go into 15 minutes. And I ain't trying to do y'all like that today. <laughs> so, once I learn the basics of a get ready with me and I can get everything done faster, I will. But other than that, you can catch this look on Instagram because I'll probably post a picture today. But I will talk to y'all later.